Okay, so this afternoon, um, my mother was wanting to order an e-voucher, and she decided to do it on the computer. And even though I had told her the e-vouchers are ordered on your phone, she wanted to print it on the computer, so she, when she went to go print it out, she came across a way to order e-vouchers on the computer, and then it got stuck, and then now we're working to troubleshoot it. So just wanted to shoot this video and explain that. So for what she was doing is she was going in and she wanted to print a voucher. And so the way to do that under my gift cards and vouchers, so she clicked that, and usually you come over here to gift cards, and then this is where you can see the current cards. However, she won she saw this order vouchers and gift cards and was like, "Oh, that's cool." So she clicked it. So one, it takes you over to Lycoonet sometimes and this is the thing too. Um honestly, I want to see what a profile looks like that is not a Lycoonet member because this is the screen that we keep getting. And so it comes over, you can just order a general voucher. So I, when I was troubleshooting, okay, so that's not exactly what she did. Though you can order vouchers, this is not ordering gift cards. This is like the Easy Shop Plus, you can order general vouchers. Okay, so going back to our troubleshooting, let's just click the back button. So this is what she clicked. So don't go ahead and click this. Then, then this is the other way when I was like, okay, wait, how did you do this, mom? Oh, one thing just so you see, so back into cashback world, if it bounces you over. So then we clicked e-voucher. And this is not going to do much for you. So I was like, mom, how did you get into this screen? And she showed me pictures of it. So here is what, um, see, this is just showing you, you order it on the app on your phone. So over here in shops, she came across, when you click on, oh, I guess we have to click on this, uh, just general search. And so she searched for Lowe's. Okay, and then it shows e-voucher. So she was like, oh, cool, I want to order an e-voucher. So this thing came up, and she went and she ordered a $100 card. I'm just going to do a sample here with 25 So, okay, so it looks like you can order it on the computer. So she went through the process like this. And the payment by cards. So this is transfer via to your shopping credit. So this is saying that you basically, you have to pay for it, I guess, afterwards. Um, I'm not sure why this option. Um, interesting. Okay, so this is what my mom went ahead and did. And... So bank transfer, she's getting paid, all this stuff. She put in her PIN. One, if you don't know how to find your PIN, just right over here, you click your name. You click on settings, and then down at the bottom left um, on that screen, it says the PIN, and it'll text you the PIN if you haven't gotten it or need it again. So anyway, so this is the process that my mom went through, and then she clicked place binding order. And then... It went to a screen, and I can, uh, I'm can. i not going to order it on this. Though basically, it was a delivery screen. And then she's like, okay, well, then that's when she called me. How do I print this? And I was like, what screen are you on? So that's how I discovered that. Oh, my goodness. So it looks like she went ahead and ordered it online, and it didn't work. And so when we were uh, going around, one, it didn't show up under her gift cards, as you saw. So two, it's like, okay, well, it wasn't showing up because she bought a hundred dollar one so it wasn't showing up here so we discovered it was under my orders and there you go this is where the one popped up that she ordered online and you can see right here there's a clock and this is why it's all paused so do not order your e-vouchers on the computer um, at least at this time because of the delay uh, oh my goodness, so that was something, and so then she saw this that we could go ahead and delete order, 
And so she clicked that to see if that would do anything. It stayed on the processing screen for about 10 minutes. Um, no, maybe like 15. It didn't do anything, so my mom said she just closed out the window. So um, one, she's going to check later if she got charged for the $100. I'm, I'm guessing she most likely did. So we have to see. Uh, this is Saturday. So by Monday, I'm going to call cash back and figure out this whole situation if it's not... Um, you know, green. And anyway, that was something that we learned. And <laughs> there we go. Always something. So, uh, the moral of the story, e-vouchers, even, um, if it shows that you can get them on the computer, do not do that on the computer. Um, whoop. so that's the screen. So this part where it says you can order e-vouchers at this time, my recommendation, don't do that. Um, you know, there's a delay. At least that's what my mom experienced. So there we go. Okay, if you need anything, please connect with me, your cashback teacher, at cashbackteacher.com.